Let's talk about this 1.0 harness real quick. What's different about it from the original 1.0 first? Um, there's been a few upgrades over the course of time, but this is, let's see, this is made by us now. New right. Tribe has retired, retired yeah. there. Yeah, so we've taken over all of the manufacturing at this point. Um, but that allowed us to do a bunch of stuff. We redesigned the suspension. It uses basically the same components as the 2.0. Um, so it's certified now. All the suspension components, mm -hmm. the life support part is basically the same. Um, it takes the same modular, you know, the setup here, the gear attachment and whatnot. So you can use all the same accessories on this harness that you can use on the 2.0. Other than that, it's basically the same as the, as the original, as the original. 1.0. Yeah, we just did a few things. So um, what he's saying, if you didn't hear him, you probably didn't. We, well, you can now move these. Yeah. So we had our storage G's locked in one spot before, and now we can move them around. And you got how many pockets? Uh, it depends on the size. So the small has six. Okay. So six, seven, eight, nine. So six pockets on the small, seven on the medium, eight on the large, and nine on the extra large. Correct. Okay, that's um, similar as the 2.0. How's it, it different? Is. The pad shape is different. It's the same pad shape as the original 1.0. That's never changed. Um, the foam in it is a little bit harder. It's a stiffer foam. Mm -hmm. um, it doesn't have the adjustable lumbar support. Yeah, no adjustable lumbar. It doesn't have lumbar. the seat strap. No Boson seat strap. Um, it's black and red. <laughs> <laughs> We're not doing customs, but now everybody's probably going to want it, so we probably will. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't know. Custom 1.0s? Um, I don't think so. Yeah. This uh, is this one is other priced change we different. We did make the the leg pad shape. We returned to a symmetrical shape, so you can switch these side to side, like the 2.0, if you want the buckles on the outside. Yeah. Um. But the 2.0 gives you a thicker, softer pad with uh, it's removable. It has the adjustable lumbar support. It has the Bosun seat built in um, and you have uh, all kinds of color choices and whatnot mm -hmm. so so what's this one priced at this one right now is 450 450 and and the other one 625 625 so yeah so we're making this more of an entry level but yet it still has a lot of the same yeah functionality as the 2.0 <laughs> it's probably going to end up being around 500 dollars like once we kind of settle out and figure out what mm -hmm. the cost of everything is that so we're now's still, the time to buy it at 450 yeah for now while we launch it we're going to keep it we had them on sale and we were working on this and we decided just to keep them that way until we get this all sorted out and right so for the next few weeks they'll be 450 and we'll give this one we're going to use this one time on today's job and we'll and we'll give this one away for 400 and it's going to come with some stuff. It's going to come with the suspenders. It's going to come with a phone pouch. So, I mean, the suspenders are 100 bucks. The phone pouch is 40 bucks. So, so this for 400. This setup for 400 is a deal. First person to call and Evan in the office and do it is the winner, I guess. Yeah. I thought we'd open it up and show it to you. Yeah, we can kind of point out a few of the differences. Mm -hmm. You can see. Um, the leg pads are the same shape now as on the 2.0. They're symmetrical, so you can switch sides. Yeah, if you want your buckles on the outside. Yeah. Um, there's minor differences, though. This webbing is sewed on straight all the way across. You have a webbing here, and you have a little bit of elastic here to give you some stretch on your little leg keeper straps. Yeah. Um, this is easier to do. Easier to <coughs> this do. This is sewed into a curve. Yeah. And this is, the entire strap is elastic and it goes all the way through here. It makes it a little more three-dimensional and it makes it a little more rigid. A little more Cadillac. It takes longer to do. It takes longer There's to do. There's a lot of little things on this harness that take longer to do. This is, we're trying to really streamline this and keep it more at an entry level price. Yeah. Um, you can see this is all one piece, the same as it was before. It's sewed through, but it's not sewed through near as much as it was before we're building 
the entire unit onto a piece of three inch wide webbing. So this belt is completed with all of the pockets and the D-rings and then it just gets sewed on the edge, which makes for a lot less crushed foam and it gives it a more rigid back panel. Um, see on this one, this is removable. 2.0, the belt comes off of it. Um, the inside is really softer Squilty. and pillowy. Mm -hmm. You have the adjustable lumbar support here. You can crank up. Uh, this has really good lumbar support. It's a tall pad. It's a, it's a heavier density foam in here, so it's stiffer than the foam in here. So you still have really good support with this belt. Um, it doesn't have the soft cushion liner though, like this one has. Um, it doesn't have the Bosun seat strap kind of hangs under the legs here. Sorry, this is a mess of stuff right now. But, um... <coughs> One, other... two, three, four, five, six. Six on the small. The medium has seven. The large has eight. Mm -hmm. Extra large has nine. Um, the... We've upgraded the adjustment buckles here. They're easy to adjust. They stay put. You can open this toggle up right here this velcro piece and pull it out and you can unthread it and replace them or you can switch out the rigging plates if for whatever reason you want to do something different there um, it's going to wear just like the original for the most part the leg pads are a little bit different um, but you're going to hang the same they might feel a little different so we basically just made this Upgraded it to the point where you can use all the 2.0 accessories and certified it. ASTM ANSI Z133 is your manufacturer date and your size. And that's pretty much it. All right, nice job. Thanks for helping us today.